Hi guys, it's Kim and I'm here today to share with you my Craft Supplies for You uh, DT project for this month, January. And this time I got a hold of some of these really cool wooden um, paint palettes. And you can see on the back it's just uh, solid wood. I actually got the, the wood piece from Blitzy. Um, they had them on sale, so I picked up a couple because I've always wanted to alter one of these big ones. So I had a lot of fun with it. Um, and I'm sure you saw in the photos, um, there's a lot of background technique on here. Um, I used some Bow Bunny paper, you can just see a bit of it here, and I ripped it um, and just put it in various places all around the um, palette. And uh, after that I got out some of my texture sprays. I used a lot of these firework sprays, I absolutely love, love, love these and they come in a lot of really good colors so um, I gave it sort of a once over with uh, a lot of the, the colored sprays and then I got a, my brick stamp which you can see here and over here um, just to, to add more dimension and then I used the Prima Damask stencil which you can also see over here as well so that sort of completed the uh, background and then after that, um, I was able to start embellishing, and um, I wanted to incorporate some cool chipboard from Gina's Design, so I love these diamonds. These are from her diamond texture sheet, so I use those. I just embossed them in black to pick up on the black stamp that's in the back there. And I just layered on several pieces here, as you can see. Um, this is another chipboard piece here from Gina, and of course Julie's um, flowers and laces are all in here as well. Um, down here you can see I've used some of her beautiful Venice trim. Um, and it, it's really just layers upon layers of really beautiful things from Julie's store. And in the center here of the clocks I've used one of her beaded appliques. And of course all of the flowers here you see are all from Julie's store. Um, the butterflies are a tattered angel. Um, you can color them, but I just kind of like them white. I thought um, it sort of set them off against the beautiful teal colors of the flowers. These are my favorite flowers. I just love these. They look so good on everything. And I also love these. They're, they're a dark uh, teal color, but they're really dark, and they just sort of set this piece off really well, having that dark color in the background. Um, I used a couple of keys from Craft Supplies for You as well. This one in the center of the butterfly here, and then this one over here on top of the clock. This is a Prima clock here, and wing, um, and then more flowers here. And these are some of Julie's parchment flowers from her store. And then you can see more of the lace. I put it right across there. And then also up here, is more of Julie's beautiful lace as well. And then I just took one of Gina's little chipboard pieces here and stamped the word art on it. And I'm really pleased with how this came out. It's it's really pretty and I'm going to hang this in my craft room. Um, but I really just love 
how the colors and the texture and everything, and I just love these paint palettes, so I'm happy I got a couple of these to alter. Um, I also want to mention, of course, that um, the link to Julie's store will be down below this video. And remember, there's coupons for international as well as domestic. So check out the coupons. There's a free shipping coupon um, as well. So all the information is on the front page of the new website. Um, and Julie's adding all kinds of new goodies every day. So definitely go over and check it out. And this is my project for right now, and I will be back very soon. I hope you guys like my paint palette. And talk to you soon. Bye, guys.